I, I gave the example that uh, one big pronouncement uh, that was made is the opening up of the China market. You see, this will improve agriculture, for instance. If um, uh, we are good at production of, say, avocados, horticultural product, uh, products and other agricultural produce, we will now have access to the China market without paying tariffs. Basically, duty-free products uh, getting into the Chinese market. That has the potential of significantly altering uh, the lives of very many uh, African people. Uh, because, you know, agriculture is largely the mainstay of most African countries. So that is a very significant uh, uh, development. For instance, um, in, other, in other jurisdictions, maybe we are negotiating in terms of strategic trade partnerships. Uh, this is something that a country like Kenya can also further with China. Uh, if I give a parallel, for instance, uh, in the U.S. you have the AGOA uh, initiative. Uh, now, if you listen to that pronouncement from China by President Xi, is, it is now even perhaps going beyond uh, the, the AGOA framework. So it's a big opportunity that is being offered to the African states.